back. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Raleigh, North Carolina. You might say the eye of the storm, or the eye of the hurricane, for that matter, as Carolina is ready to roll. The Hurricanes are going to start with the puck after taking the opening draw. And that's poked away. Moves it to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Oh, we'll get some tired defenders as icing is the call. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Still looking for our first goal. And they take possession here in the offensive zone and time to go on the attack. Center bears down on that bottom hand. A clean win, and you can see them all setting up, looking to attack the net against this tired group. Great four check by Aho. Puck grab by Svechnikov. And it's a quick pass to Slavin. And he takes a shot. He scores! A little pop up for the play. Well, this is an unlucky bounce. As a defender, you're in the middle of the ice trying to clear out any kind of traffic, and the puck just hits you, deflects, and goes into your own net. That's a tough one to take. The Hurricanes and their fans are buzzing right now. How about that? A quick strike just minutes into this one. Well, that quick strike gets them on their feet, and listen, when you're playing, you can feel that energy. You feed off it when your home crowd is cheering for you, especially when you're playing well. No better way than getting on the board first. Back to the blue line. And now it's grabbed by Burns. Tries to get it, but terrifying. Quick pass to Stahl. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Hubel. Tampa Bay is looking to break out of their own end. Feeds it over to Hedman. The Hurricanes still holding the puck. Moves it to the middle. James that beats the goaltender, but how about the will to get to those tough areas? I mean, that's what it's all about. You can have the skill, but you gotta have the will. Well past the midway mark of this period, we are all tied up in this one. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Along the half wall with the puck. That's turned away with the pad by Anderson. Knocked away by Radish. Tampa Bay's got the puck along the boards. 
And now he moves it quickly to Paul. Takes a shot, and that goes wide. You gotta get a shot on that, James. You get in tight, you have an opportunity in that scoring area, and you don't even get a shot on net, not good enough. And now he angles it across to Martin. Here's a shot, and there it is, stopped by Vasilevsky. Puck possession so critical in today's game, and the official ready to drop the puck right here. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Great use of the stick in the defensive end by Glenn Denning. Into the attacking area from the left side. Shea's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. Hammers the shot. Oh, and it goes off his glove. And he gets down to block it. Chris shot from the slot. Just gets enough to keep it up. Tremendous pressure here in the offensive end. They're coming in waves. Another chance. And there's the whistle. They've drawn a penalty with all this relentless pressure. Another big face-off looming as this power play rolls on here tonight. Inside the final minute of the first here. Gets a piece of it to make the save. Well, this save was way more difficult than it looked, James. I mean, there's so much traffic in front that he's fighting through to see, and he finds the puck to make the save. We're tied up on the draw. You kidding me? Two goals in ten seconds. Cheryl, you stretch consistently. Keep your feet moving on the ice, and that pays off. But they got the pedal to the metal right now. They're like a freight train. Well, that's a really tough break for the tender, James. I mean, listen, when structure breaks down and there's all kinds of stuff going on in front of you, you can't track, you can't get your eyes on the puck, and it winds up in the back of your neck. Number one in the books. First intermission entertainment is on deck here. You can also have time to go grab a drink, grab a hot dog, and we'll be back with period number two in moments. And the opening face-off here in period number two is about set. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up for the first 20 minutes? The Hurricanes have a two-goal lead here. It's pretty comfortable. Why? Because they've been dominating in terms of getting shots through to the net. If they can keep up that shooting clinic, they're going to go up by more. Svechnikov's a cheeky player that doesn't shy away from using the cross moves to add flair to his game. 
he'll either scoop it up and flip it over to a teammate, or he'll put it on net himself. Either way, the defense will have their hands full with him tonight, guys. Made the save on the play. I really like the save, James, because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. Here's a chance to cut! He scores! What a play! I really like the way they move the puck around to wait for the right time to be able to move that puck for the one-timer in that low slot area. He didn't have much time to get it off, but he got some wood on it and buried it. The Lightning have shown a burst of life here after that strike, Cheryl. They're ready to go now. They showed a lot of punch there to get themselves within one, James. They're on their toes, but most importantly, they're attacking and they're driving the net right now. Close save, and he handles it with ease. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Bolts have answered back in these last few minutes, but still need one more to even the score. Steps in front of that one. Here they come, down the left side on the attack. From the top of the offensive zone here. Scores! And the scratching and clawing has paid off as we are back to even. Well, we're back to evens, James. I really like their game. I mean, when you're pushing and you're trying to find a way to get ahead and on top, you have to trust the process. That's exactly what they've done, and they've been rewarded for it. The goaltender, he's going to want this one back, James. I thought that he was set to position. Just the blast of the shot, it hit him. He got a good chunk of it, but it went in. You can see the frustration in the body language. Play ready to resume as everybody lines in for the faceoff. The Bolts get a hold of the draw. The Hurricanes gain control of the puck. have gone in front by one here in the second period. Yeah, and it certainly changes the mindset when you're ahead by one in a very close deadlock game, James. Now they got to push the pace, put the pedal to the metal, and try and figure out a way to cash in again. The Bolts have it now. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Picked up along the wall by Burns. one for the most part, but suddenly they're right back into it after that strike. They're able to cut their deficit in half and they've stayed the course, James. The ability to be hard on the puck focus. They're pushing hard to get the equalizer. They've got the defense outnumbered. Here's a shot. And it caroms off the club and it stays out. Carolina's crossed the line and on the attack. Shot! And that's blocked away. 
Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. Passes over to Paul. Inside the defensive zone, moving the puck. Quick pass to Sergachev. Poked away at center by Isimo. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Isimon's got a lot of flash to his game, in particular with his hands and the ability to manipulate his opponent, but he gets caught on that one and the puck dies on his stick. And that plays offside. We got a face-off coming up. Centers are lined up and we are ready to resume. Gains possession with both centers all tied up in the draw. To the most slot! Denies him in close. Goaltender spent so much time doing tracking exercises, and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from, and he makes the save. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. The Bolts looking against the half wall. And that's poked away by Chatfield. Here he is, Tristan on that. Scores! And we are back to even. Yeah, tie game now, James. I really like the energy that they've showed throughout the game, but now it's about channeling the energy they've just created and doing something with it. The Bolts have set this up to be a dramatic one tonight. They put themselves in a good position here at the end of the second period. Isn't it ain't easy to get goals in this game, but they got the equalizer, and it's a nice step heading into the third period. Here's a shot. Oh, we got a piece of it to keep it out. Let's it go. Oh, wow, another great stop. Looks like there's a delayed penalty being called here by the officials. And the puck stop retains his man to get the extra attacker on the ice. There's the whistle, and here's the call. Well, tough timing to take a penalty at the end of a period. You want to make sure that you can reset and regroup, but first things first, you've got to kill the penalty. Defensive zone face-off. We've played not one, but two periods now tonight. It's a chance to go grab that final snack. Go stretch your legs, because a big third period is just around the corner. Opening face-off for period number three is ready to go. Tampa Bay's shorthanded unit gets off to a good start. They win the draw and take early possession. Working the puck deep inside their own end. With possession along the wall. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Picked up along the boards by Gensel. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Now he slides it up to Mott. Jarvis draws a penalty. Looks like a slashing call coming up here. And there's the whistle stopping the play. The Lightning have been penalized for slashing. I won't be surprised to see the 1-3-1 again. They had success on it earlier, James. And listen, I love this. I coach this with my team because I love the bumper spot and I love the net front player. You're taking away the eyes of the goaltender, but you can also pop out below the goal line and present as an option. So multiple variations that can strike. Gains the zone through the middle. Duclair's penalty has expired, but they remain short-handed and he joins the kill. Good stop by Vasilevsky. We know the goaltender was set to this position, square to the shooter, to be able to make that glove save. Kuznetsov's ready for the draw on this man advantage. Tampa Bay's taking possession in their own end. Now a quick pass to Hagel. Tampa Bay's looking to break out. Handles the pass. Puck picked up by Paul. Tries it to the crease. Turns it away. Time running out on this power play. They've got one last chance here. Both sides back to even strength. 
A great effort by the penalty killers there. Well, I really like this PK unit, James. Just working in sync, almost as if they're on a pendulum or a string together, knowing exactly what the other is going to do and the reason they're still tied. Hagel's taking the puck now here inside his own territory. Handles the pass at center. Tampa Bay's got the puck. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Intercepts it at center. Scooped up along the wall by Nelson. Glittering field! And that's stopped. Broken up by Kucherov. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Vasilevsky's really impressed me tonight, James. Just look at that last sequence and that desperation save. Unbelievable. I mean, when it's required to be calm and poised, he's got quiet feet. But when he needs to move and make a desperation play, he does it. Puts it on net. Oh, what a close save by Anderson. Some last-second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. The Bolts win the draw, and they go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Dismiss that chance. Through center along the wing. Takes a shot. Oh, he stops him with a glove. Great reflexes there. Dennings won it in their own end. Moves the puck. Quick feed to Mott. Tampa Bay's got him along the wall. The Hurricanes gain possession. Referee's hand goes up in the air. We got a delayed penalty coming up here. Another stick infraction, and you know that coaches don't like this one. A product of not being in good position, reaching, and then taking the trip because you weren't moving your feet. I'm almost out here for the power play, guys. We know who's got that zone ability, and it could be a weapon here as they try to get on the board with the special teams. Ajo's got the puck, and they'll go on the attack. Slides it over with pace to Stamkos. Tampa Bay is going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. Moves it on over to Sergeyev. The Bolts are across the line and into the offensive end. Shot! Big time blocker step by Anderson. Here's a short pass to Burns. Takes it into the slot. Sorelli's looking around near the point with the stop. 
Grabbed along the board by Radish. 32 seconds left on the clock. 29 seconds left. Hard hit frees up the puck. Here we go. Look at this. They are really applying the squeeze down in the offensive end. is the call will get a face up at the other end. Tampa Bay's been very active offensively tonight, but they just have not been able to finish on their scoring chances here late in the third. Final hold the sound of bringing this one to an end. Lots of power play goals in this one, and this is just showing a team that was just outworking the opposition. And you're putting them on their heels, wearing them down, opportunities, James, but you have to find a way to cash in when you get them, or the momentum can go the other way. They capitalized, and it's the reason they were successful tonight. It is time for the storm surge, and this has absolutely captivated the hockey universe, never mind just here. Well, tradition is tradition. I mean, when you have it within your team, you want to salute your fans. There's nothing better than the storm surge to get the crowd a rumbling. Well, that'll bring an end to an exciting night of hockey. And for all of us here at EA Sports, including Danny, Matt, Natalia, all in the truck, I'm James. She's Cheryl. Good night, everybody.